Don't tell me what to do. Not all I really want. I keep forgetting I need to buy the soundtrack for this game. Yeah, yep, I understand. Um, yeah, I have a Twitter, uh, Vasive Plays, Vasive underscore Plays. I have a link in my info in the bottom. Uh, you can tag me there or, um, how do you... How do you send a whisper in Twitch mobile? I don't remember. Um, but yeah, whisper DM on t uh, Twitch works fine as well. All right, I don't think anything else has changed, but I, I kind of want to check it out. Ooh, thanks for the image, Nathan. And everybody here thinks Samuel is a creeper. I keep that. I guess it's evidence. All right, let's see if we got Glad any messages. Lee doesn't waste a second exploiting Kate. Now she has another video of herself I was just gonna all say, over the web. God damn it. And even I'm in this one. Oh, at least the news didn't mention my name yet. What was that? Celtic Witch, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the crew. Appreciate you being here. Thanks for dropping in. Welcome, welcome. Huh. Besides Rachel, it's been a while since anybody vanished from Arcadia Bay. I shouldn't sound so disappointed. I sure hope these people treat her better when she comes back to school. If she does. It will soon. You are in our hearts thinking of you. You're all behind. Yes! Oh, this makes my heart happy. Oh, man. This actually makes me, like, choke up. Please. Either I delete my page or I block everybody. Nowhere to hide these days. Error comes out of the woodwork. Ugh, I don't know any of these. There's Juliet. Dana! I like you. You're cool. Uh, I don't remember what Dura means. Dura actually made me proud. Okay. Everybody will be talking about Kate. Oh, now. let's check our plant. Blackwell might as well. First, I save Chloe, then Kate, and now you, Lisa. <laughs> Not a bad record for a yeah. Week. I made uh, the plant be better. <gasps> oh, this is Kate's bunny. Me, bunny. Here, nosh on this. He misses his mom. I think that's Kate's bunny. Hey, bunny. Kate will be back yeah. soon. And until then, I'll be catering to your every whim. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry, guys. I'm going to revel in this little part of the game for a little bit so we can actually like get back to base. Chill out for a second. Hopefully you guys are cool with that. This is heavy. You don't think it worked? Uh, did you send a Twitter or a Twitch message? Oh boy. All right. Apparently there's nothing else to do. All right. Let's check ourselves out. Okay. It's okay, Max. Take a breath. Get your shit together. You have time. You need to go take a shower. Cause that's uh, that's heavy stuff. Jeebus, I am so freaking tired. <laughs> I sound like a moron, but crime does not delay. I need to stay on top of this investigation. All right, let's do this. Oh, no, we already did that. All right. Oof. OK, 
Okay, this is scary dark. Let there be... Please don't turn into a horror game. Wherever you go, there I am. We'll wait for Kate. Man. All right. So real talk right here. This is stuff that's upsetting me because normally I'm like, that's cool. But Brooke and uh, what was it? Juliet. Weren't they like watching the video and gossiping all about it in the hallway? Like not very far from Kate's room. I better go room? meet up with Chloe. No, I don't like I don't like the two face. Maybe it was Stella. I don't think it was Stella. I don't know. What did I write? I can't read that. I hope you burn bright again soon, Kate. Tiger Tiger burning right in the forest of the night. What a mortal hand. What a mortal hand. I hope you burn bright again. Or I soon, could Kate. frame thy fearful symmetry. Blake for Kate Marsh. Okay. Barricade tape. Is this Kate's room? Yeah. So much hypocrisy. Yeah, thank you. Someone said I'm sorry, Kate. Man, that's probably the heart one is probably Victoria's. Ooh, don't like you, Victoria. Do they really need that crap on the door? Kate's still alive. No balls allowed. Okay. What do we got here? Vortex Club. They don't have a thing. Anything going on in the bathroom? What's her name? This isn't Courtney. Is this Taylor? Hi. What's up? Hey, Max. I saw you go up on the roof and save Kate. I can't believe she really? tried to jump. You can't believe that? You can't believe that? I really want to blame her. I wish I didn't talk to her. Because you were one of the people that put her up on that roof. Oh, no problem, Celtic or Celtic. Thank you for dropping in. I hope I caught you in time. Appreciate being here and thank you for the follow. Oh, it worked. Awesome. Good to know. Fragger votes on blaming her. I really want to. However, there's the side of me that's like. Is taking that stupid quote that freaking Victoria has on her stupid board. Be the change you want to see in the world, right? And like an eye for an eye that makes the whole world blind, not all kinds of crap. It's like you don't fight evil with evil. Ooh, Our I have team. my powers though, right? I'm just so glad she didn't. Are you okay? I'm just like shocked. I've never seen anybody try to kill themselves before. Me neither. I didn't think you'd be so upset considering how much shit you and Victoria. There it is. Paid. That's what I'm, I'm my looking own for. My person, not Victoria's bitch. Hello, like she's freaking too. She already broke her. Is she really? <gasps> shit, I'm not supposed to tell anybody. Where did she go? I know I can trust you since you were so nice asking about my mom in the hospital, but Victoria will like make my life hell if I blab, okay? No doubt. I do hope your mother gets better. Let me know if you need anything. See, Thanks. that's how you should be like. You're like weird, but pretty cool, Max. 
Especially after watching you go up on that roof. Victoria's wrong about you. Now I have to be alone for my nightly anxiety attack. Talk to you later. Mm. Mines is always the best option. Third option should be throw a haymaker. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, like... I'll say this, guys. Like, I talk a big game about, like... Punch him out, burp, burp, stuff, and like that's that's a video game in real life. Like, don't fight evil with evil. Like, it's oh, Victoria, don't sink yourself to that level. Maybe I'll just wait and bide my time going through her shit. Be a good person. Hey, Max, that includes hey. everyone. Waiting for you, Kate, Juliet. What does that say? No money, no money. Something I can't read. Who just is this Dana? Keep calling her Dana. I meant Dana. Hey. Paper ball. This is I'll read it this sad time. and pathetic. Oh, that's a dude's letter. Hey, it's Dana. Dana looks guilty and relieved about Kate. She really does care. See, I like Dana. Like, she's one of the popular kids, but she's a legit person, too. Yes, the Vortex oh. Club does indeed suck. Like, she doesn't have that stupid I'm better than thou mentality, at least hey, not Dana. that we've seen. How are you doing? Better than Kate. I just can't believe she would even attempt suicide. Yeah, we're all responsible. I think we're all responsible for what happened. True. But you're the only one who went up to that roof with Kate. I was lucky. That's all. No, girl. That was not luck. You made a choice to save her. Like a superhero. Then maybe it's time to catch the bad guys. So what exactly are you saying, Max? You think this has something to do with Nathan being Rest in pompous. Hold on a minute. I'm gonna message. I gotta check things. No, I, I can respond to that later. Okay. Don't mind me. Crap, what did she say? Dang it, I do this all the time. Does anyone know what she just said? And what I'm supposed to react to? Like, uh, was it like, what are we supposed to do next to take down the bad guys? Was that it? I'm not sure yet. It's complicated. I don't want to drag you into this, okay? Not yet, anyway. I'm getting scared now. But people here are still sneaking out tonight. What? Like, who? Victoria bounced out of here earlier, and now you, Sherlock? Not me. I need a break from today. Get some sleep too, Dana. I'll see you later. I shouldn't use her laptop. Aw, Trevor is a sweetie. I've been thinking about Dana. you all day. And I know how hard it was for you to see Kate almost jump from the roof today. Glad that Max swooped in like a superhero. I don't have anything deep or smart to say. I just want you to know that you're a good friend to Kate. And I wish you had more friends like you. You've been so good to me. For me. To me for me. And everything else is so fucked up, and I'm here for you always. I miss you. If Dana talks to Juliet about this, she's gonna wish she didn't. Dana, I hope you're doing okay after today. I don't want to bother you, but I'm writing an article about Kate for the paper, and I want to know if you could answer just a few short questions. It seems like there are a few, few, few answers. Let's talk when this is convenient for you, okay? Mm. Oh, she has a reply. Thank you so much for thinking of me. I keep seeing Kate on the roof, and I feel like I should... I've done something more to help her. Max did more than anybody to save Kate, and I didn't even think they're BFF. So happy you're thinking about me. I can't wait to see you tomorrow, and you are just as good to, for me as you think I am for you. Dreaming of you tonight. Oh, they're adorable. Hi, Julie. I know you want to find out more about Kate, but I'm still a little shaken up after today. I don't think you'll get too many answers so soon after what happened today. And maybe it's better to keep low profile for the moment. Kate deserves some privacy for change. Yes! 
Dana, I love you. Stop freaking hounding Kate. Jeez. Let her have an ounce of normalcy for a change. That is so damn cute how much Dana is into this Halloween party. Who's crying? Do you? No. The murder thing went away. Stella, Kate, just want you to know you're in our thoughts. Praying for fast recovery, Kate. All right, let's do this. Whew. People work for the news just want to get. Yeah, exactly. So Chloe is waiting for me in front of the main hall. All right, we're going to go check out Samuel's shed, see if this is open. Oh, Leah's. Oh, it's unlocked. I hope Samuel isn't around. And he immediately regrets this decision. Girl stuff. Oh no. I know Samuel doesn't wear silky scarves. So who does? Mm. Who knew Samuel was so into runway fashion? I was hoping it was just weird. Not like actual real time Nuts scary weird. Bolts. Like my grandpa's garage. Nothing but tools. That's, this whole school is full of them. Ha! Nothing here. What exactly am I looking for, apparently? Magazine. Oh, I'm getting messages. Crap. Sorry, Chloe. Hold up. missed a lot find out together yo super max how's the blackwell hero doing the hero is still shaking with nerves and i even got nathan prescott suspended you're a boss but no emoji <laughs> listen something weird and scary is going on at blackwell it's time for us to put the pieces together cool i have something to show you meet me in front of campus get that ass in gear now max took some pictures all right oh my god we have like 10 journals to read buckle up kids we in this for real objective i have to meet up with chloe oh that's nice uh okay next speaking of expectations david madsen talked to me without being a total prick i wanted to tear him a new one for hitting chloe thinking i could rewind if things got out of a control and he didn't seem sufficiently sorry to me. I know Chloe provokes him, but that's no fucking excuse to hit someone, especially a family member. I see that David is sorry and trying to reach out to me. I know he saw terrible things in combat. I just can't trust him in his paranoid surveillance fetish, especially with how weird he acts with Kate, like she's a criminal. I'll give David props for trying to smoke the peace pipe with me, but he acts like he's still at war. Everything odd happened, as if everything happening isn't bizarro, but I saw Kate having an intense conversation with Mr. Jefferson, and she ended up practically running away from him in tears. I wish I could have casually asked, Oh, by the way, what's up with Kate? He would tell me anyway. I know Kate treats Jefferson like he's an apostle or something, but what did he say to make her so upset? Just when I was feeling good about Chloe and me, I walk into Jefferson's class and see Nathan and Victoria actually sitting on my desk. Unreal. Asshole bookends. <laughs> I love this photo right here. Kate with her little wings. That's giving me the feels of, uh, like the companion cube. Like, I just love it. Like the, the companion cube drawings and the hidden wall areas where the companion cube has the little wings. I remember wanting a tattoo of that for a while. Kate Marsh almost killed herself. My hands are still shaking, but I have to write this down while I can. Right at the start of Jefferson's class, Case went to the roof of the girls' dorm to jump. Every student and teacher was watching her like it was a Blackwell rooftop concert. I saw her actually jump, but I was just about able to use my rewind to get, back, to get her back on the roof. I tried harder than I ever did, and somehow I stopped time completely. 
Oh, she stopped time. Okay. Made it to the roof, but again, my head felt like it was going to blow up. I knew that I couldn't just keep her whining to save Kate. I had to try and talk her down on my own. She was already in so much pain over the video and all the bullying, so she wasn't going to buy everything I tried to tell her. You see movies with people trying to talk somebody out of suicide, but that's very different when I'm the one doing the talking. I covered everything I could and Kate almost jumped anyway. Cliche or not, I told her how much her friends and family love her, even if they don't all show it now. Lo and behold, Kate stepped back from the ledge, alive. I almost cried in her arms. Heck freaking yes, I did. 